So this contact, this controlling contactor for the compressor, will open if this safety opens. And that, at that point, that becomes an interlock. It could also be to where when this safety closes, it will not close this relay until 60 seconds later. Okay, so that would be where it would function as a time delay device. Every relay, the bases will be the same. The bases are universal. Okay, what's different is the physical relay you buy. And you should be able to take whatever relay model number, look it up on Google, typically, and you can pull up some form of schematic from the manufacturer. A lot of times it will be like blue or black, big old boxes about, you know, a couple inches long, big old square thing. Uh, and they may even have some dials on it where you can fine tune. Uh, you even see them, they use them for three phase uh, interlock controls. It's another example. It could be your, your three phase monitor in some scenarios. Uh, that's, that's what your logic relay is. So you need to know what these termination pins mean in order for it to, for you to even begin to troubleshoot it. If you don't have those pin terminations and what they're supposed to be, you're wasting time. You gotta find that first before you even proceed.